Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. Kathleen Hart here from the Little Piece of Heart blog. You're in the right place if you're looking for anything that is low carb diet related. Today's video is going to be a recipe video. I'm super excited. This is gonna be my low carb cauliflower Mexican rice. It is so easy, so delicious. And if you didn't wanna have it low carb, you could easily substitute the cauliflower for some cooked rice of your choice. Now, this is not an authentic recipe at all. So if you're looking for that, you're in the wrong place, but if you're looking for a quick and easy shortcut recipe, you guys are going to love this one. So let's get on into it. Let's start off first with the cauliflower. You're gonna need about four cups of cauliflower that has been riced. Now to get this rice consistency, you can either pop this into a food processor and pulse it until it has the texture that we see here, just little rice kernels, or you could also use a box grater and you just use the regular grater setting and you just grate away until you have the whole thing done. This was approximately half of a medium, medium large size cauliflower. And as you can see, I'm a little bit shy of four cups, but this is gonna do the trick perfectly. You're also gonna need some taco seasoning. This is my homemade taco seasoning. I'm getting a little low, I have to make some more, but you could easily make this yourself or you could just use a packet from the store. I will link my recipe for my taco seasoning down below in the description box. So you're also gonna need a scallion and I'm gonna chop this and then I'm gonna separate the white parts, so about up until here, and then the green parts. So we're gonna use the white parts in the pan with the cauliflower and then we're gonna top it with the green tops. Now let's talk salsa real quick. This is the salsa that I'm gonna be using today. This salsa, I really like the brand because the ingredients are good ingredients. There's nothing crazy in here. There's nothing you can't pronounce. It is all real food and the carbs are very, very low. You also wanna use a salsa that is low carb, but a salsa that tastes good. So if you don't like the taste of it, obviously don't use it in this recipe. This is my favorite. This is even better because of the carb count. So just be careful though, because the spice on this says medium, the other one is mild. So just watch that when you are making it because it will be a little spicy if you use a medium salsa. But you could use either one of these today and I'm sure they would be amazing. I love this brand of salsa and I highly, highly recommend it. The only other thing we're gonna need for this is a little bit of butter. So let's get on over to the stove and start making this Mexican cauliflower rice. Hashtag not authentic. Not the easiest recipe you've probably ever seen me make, but let me tell you, it is delicious. This is perfect to make for meal prep. It's also great to make alongside of so many different Mexican food inspired dishes, all low carb, of course. You can make burrito bowls and have this as your base. You could make fajita chicken, which my recipe for that will be coming soon. Once it is, I will put it in the description box, but this literally is perfection. It's one of my favorite lunches. Even just to have this as a snack with a little bit of sour cream on top, it is delicious. I know you guys are gonna love it too. If you guys like this one, give me a thumbs up and make sure to be subscribed to my channel so you don't miss any new low carb tips, tricks, and recipes. With all that said, I will see you all in my next video. Bye everybody.